what is up everybody and welcome back to another one of my videos as y'all can tell by the title this video will be a diy pedicure video yes y'all it has been at least a good three months since i had a good pedicure and as you can tell i still got my gel polish on but it's okay because i'm going to be showing you how you can rejuvenate your feet and get your feet looking like it was done at the shop right at home so if you're interested then make sure you keep on watching this video and subscribe to my channel okay so starting off i'm going to be using this bubble bath that i just got from walmart and since I don't have like a foot soak or anything like that, I'm just going to be running me some hot bath water and soaking my feet. And guys, you can be really creative with this. You can really add whatever you want to your water. I highly recommend adding Epsom salt and maybe even some essential oils. Now that I've let my feet soak for about 15 minutes, I'm just going to be going in with my hand file and really just going at this gel polish because it has been on there for quite some time and it was actually really hard to get off. So I'm just going to be really working this file trying to get the rest of this loose polish off. I did not get the clip of me actually going in with a cuticle stick but after you soak your feet make sure you're going in with either like a cuticle stick or some type of cuticle remover while your feet are still really wet to just really get all of that dead skin in between your cuticles. This step is so crucial because having clean cuticles is what actually makes a good pedicure. Moving on, I'm gonna be going in with my toenail clipper and I'm just making sure my nails are low because I don't wanna be walking around here with no long toes, scratching myself or nobody else. So it doesn't have to be perfect, but I'm just making sure they're cut low enough and somewhat even. Now moving on to the actual fun part and if you ask me the most important part of the whole pedicure and this here is a foot file. Y'all this is so important when it comes to removing all of that dead skin from your foot and really getting those calluses on the back of your heel and even toes. If you don't do anything else at least go in with this foot file so you can make sure you have nice and smooth feet. If you've seen my skincare routine video, then y'all know I love this brown sugar, sugar scrub for exfoliating. And I'm just gonna be putting this on my foot just to really exfoliate further and to get those rough areas of my feet. Thank you. 
after all of that scrubbing and exfoliating y'all it is time to finally paint our toes and here i am just showing you this cuticle oil oh my gosh i just think that looks so freaking pretty and adorable and i'm just gonna be putting this right along my cuticles as soon as i'm done painting my toenails you do not have to necessarily add cuticle oil but adding it does increase circulation around your nails and it also stimulates nail growth Here is the before of my feet as you can see my heels look real crusty and you can just kind of see the calluses around my toes and they look really rough and that is a big no no here is the final outcome of my pedicure y'all my feet are so much more smoother like butter and they just feel way better to touch i don't feel any of those rough patches not only is this super simple but it's also convenient considering everything that's going on in the world not only that but it's way more cheaper y'all y'all can save y'all some money by doing it yourself but yeah you let me know what y'all think in the comments don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and also follow me on all of my social medias and i'll see y'all in the next video